police out in force in Kampala, just one of the several Ugandan cities seized by protests over the arrest of pop star turned politician Bobby Wine. The demonstrations quickly turned deadly. On Thursday, authorities said more than a dozen had been killed. Police are just attacking us. Bobby Wine is supposed to be meeting and convincing our people, but now he's in jail again. They are just trying to waste time. Protests were sparked by Wine's arrest in the eastern town of Luka on Wednesday. Police said he had violated coronavirus measures at his rallies. The opposition leader was then taken to Jinja, where demonstrators blocked roads and chanted Bobby Wine's slogan. The situation degenerated with robberies, lootings and, in some cases, police firing live bullets. By Thursday, about 350 protesters had been arrested. 38-year-old Wine has attracted a widespread following through his pop songs about social justice and corruption. He's hoping to replace long-ruling president Yoweri Museveni in January's general elections, where the 76-year-old incumbent will be seeking a sixth term. Wine has been arrested multiple times since announcing he would run for president.